This video contains no jeans outfits whatsoever. In today's video, I've got some outfit ideas for the winter that you can wear instead of wearing jeans. Skirts are the feminine alternative to wearing jeans and possibly the more comfortable choice. The wonderful thing about wearing skirts in the winter is that there's so many different styles to choose from. The midi skirt comes in all different fabrics and slightly different styles. The skirts with a more A-line, wool skirts, satin skirts, leather skirts, denim skirts, but whatever fabric, or style of, of midi skirt you choose it does look great with knee-high boots either with or without a heel they can be layered with tights a slip long sleeve top underneath and with cardigans and coats the other option is a pencil skirt which I tend to prefer they look lovely with a cardigan and a shirt or look fabulous with a roll neck sweater either a tighter fitting one or slightly looser Whilst they're not quite as easy to layer up because they're figure hugging, tights do work beautifully under the skirt because they smooth everything down underneath. Three gorgeous ways to wear a pencil skirt in the winter is to wear a coloured skirt with a different coloured top and coat which matches with boots or wear all the same colour or very similar shades from head to toe which looks absolutely wonderful. Or well, the third option is you could wear the same colour underneath and a coloured or a pattern coat over the top. I've put this look together myself with a black roll neck, black skirt, black tights, boots and bag and then I've added a pattern coat or you could do the same look with the solid colour. And then you could wear whatever style shoes or boots whatever you prefer. I've mixed this around a few ways with a small heel. These come from Ali Shoes and I've tried that with the crossbody bag. This is from Aspinall. The coat is by Helene Berman. I don't usually go for prints but I really wanted to try this dog tooth print. The other way I've tried this is with the top handle bag and I have tried it with some black flats too. I never really like myself in flat shoes but obviously they're more practical. As the bag has gold hardware, I've added a black watch with gold detailing. This is from Nord Green. Now a gorgeous classy way to wear a watch in the winter is over the sweater like this. It's a really stylish way to dress up a winter outfit. So I've tried it with my watch. This is the native watch which has a black and gold dial and a black leather strap. Now currently Nord Green do have 30% off for Black Friday but I have a code so you can get a whopping 35% off which is quite a discount. I've worked with Nord Green now for a while and their watch pieces are very understated yet elegant. They're a Danish watch brand and they're a brand that truly cares about the environment and about people. They donate to three global NGOs which are Water for Good, Pratham UK and Cool Earth. And if you purchase a watch you actually get to choose which cause you support, which is a great idea. Sustainability is also very important to them. All the packaging is made of upcycled plastic bottles and FFC certified cartons, which always surprises me because it's such beautiful packaging. You'd never guess it was made out of recycled plastic bottles. They plant thousands of trees every year to offset carbon emissions which is generated by the shipping and they do offer a variety of vegan products and refurbished products. This is a vegan watch strap and this is also the native watch face. It's really great quality for a vegan product and the tones of this I think look lovely with creams and beiges. I'd wear this over the sleeve of the jumper just like the other watch or just normally with a cream knit and cardigan and maybe even a sweater dress. The code to use for 35% off is WTW35 and I'll link that below for you. Beautiful dresses aren't just for the warmer months, now they're trans-seasonal. So with some really simple styling tricks, they can look chic but comfortable and warm. One of the nicest styles of dresses to wear in the winter is the sweater or the jumper dress, but typically they either come up quite short or they sometimes can be a bit shapeless or to figure hugging. It can actually be quite hard to find one in just the right style for what you're after. I like these from Holland Cooper but they are premium so they're not cheap but the beauty of a jumper dress is that it can last for years and years. The first and obvious way to wear the sweater dress in the winter is with tights underneath. Depending on the tightness of the dress will depend how thick you can go with your tights for extra warmth. If you have a bit more room in your dress you can swap the tights for fleece lined leggings. 
Another thing you can do if you are wearing boots with your dress, you, you can layer your tights with socks. This will help keep your feet nice and snugly and warm. Underneath your dress, you could add a long sleeve figure hugging top. I like these from Nordstrom. These are great for under sweater dresses. They're not too thick, so they won't bulk up underneath the dress and will still provide some extra warmth. And these are not expensive. They're around about 15 pounds. If you do need more warmth, you could wear a thermal top similar to this. And it's not very glamorous, but if you tuck your top into your tights, it will keep you nice and warm around the middle area. If your dress is made of a fine knit wool, you could layer a cardigan over the top of the jumper dress, something like this, but a winter version. A shorter cardigan would, would also look great with the belt over the top, but I think this is something that you would have to be very careful with. I couldn't wear that as it would bulk me up far too much, but if you're slim on the hips, and round the waist it could look quite wonderful. Layering a sweater over the dress is another option but this would only really work if the sweater dress is longer like this one without a roll neck and you could always wear a belt over the top of the dress and pair that with a cardigan. Another thing you could wear under your dress is a slip. They're not actually very common these days but they can help stop the fabric sticking to your legs and it adds another layer of warmth. Add a fabulous coat over your dress something that is either longer than the dress or of similar length but do avoid long coats that aren't long enough for the dress it looks very unbalanced and it's really not a great look on top of your coat add a beautiful scarf and maybe even a hat on the outside you'll look fabulously elegant in your sweater dress whilst underneath there's a lot going on keeping you warm and no one needs to know about it Love them or hate them, leggings are the more comfortable alternative choice to wearing jeans. But if you are going to wear them, you've got to invest in some really good quality ones that aren't see-through. The only way I think leggings should be worn is with a long line top that finishes just below the bottom, which is far more flattering. Here's a great example of the Duchess of Cambridge doing just that. Her sweater is a roll neck and it's loose and long. Because it's the same colour as the trousers, it looks seamless. She's wearing her Penelope Chilvers boots, I think, with a jacket, which is also a great length. This is another way that she's done it. In the winter, leggings work perfectly with boots and look great in the country chic way. Black leggings and black tops look great together with either boots or ballerina flats look nice just depending how cold it is where you are. You do have to be careful with the length of the top though, as if it's too long, it will make your legs look like little stumps. Another variation on a tunic top with leggings is to wear a white shirt underneath. These colors really look gorgeous together. Front slit leggings are in style right now, and they look great warm with some heels. So if you've got somewhere smart to go over the festive season, this could be an option with a blazer maybe or a spot print shirt. A glamorous way to wear them is with a knee high boot with a small heel paired with some taupe knitwear. Pick some knitwear in a longer length and add a scarf for a really gorgeous combination. Wide leg trousers aren't for everyone, but it is an option. And in my opinion, it's a really classy option. The wide leg trousers can be layered underneath for extra warmth so you could easily wear tights and socks under some trousers like this and wear some ankle boots maybe. Or you could wear a flat loafer and then layer it up with a wool blazer or coat, add a scarf and it'll look wonderful. Here's a gorgeous pair of wide leg trousers. They look white in the picture but they are actually pink. Such an elegant outfit combination. The shoes could be swapped for something more practical and then the whole look could be layered with a coat in a similar shade. If you do like a more casual look, this could be for you. It looks a very comfortable outfit to me, but still very stylish. You could always wear a different coat as well. A biker jacket would work or a wool coat. Wide leg trousers can be a nice, comfortable alternative to jeans. Perfect for casual day wear or for a dressier evening outfit.